Hey you guys, we're back with another video, as you could probably tell from the title. Baby girl has made her early debut. She would not let me go to the end of this month. She's supposed to come in June, y'all. She came 36 weeks, 6 days. So, the postpartum recovery after labor let me tell y'all i'm only what a day into this huh you put her? yeah you can come dad's on, come about on. to put her in the stroller he's obsessed with her let me show y'all how much hair she got look at all the hair yeah look at my dog she got that good good <laughs> i'm recording the video but y'all uh, um so I actually had came from school. My job was Saturday was supposed to be my last day for school. Um, I was gonna start leave, you know, try to start nesting, getting things together. And y'all, when I came home, what was it? Tuesday, Tuesday night. Well, Wednesday, two a.m. My water had broke in the bed, and I had a baby. And I did not record. I told myself that I was going to record, but... Oh, I got you in the bed in the hospital. That look at my... I'm you recorded the whole thing? No, I didn't record the whole thing. What's I can that? only remember certain things. Like, after a while, I, come, I was in so much pain. Like, them contractions. I wonder why they do that. But, them contractions, y'all, I, I got an epidural. I was trying to hold out, oh, but I couldn't do it. Could not do it. Them contractions were coming in strong. I was getting getting them like every two to three minutes. And I was like, I can't do this. I couldn't. So I was admitted like around two something. And I had her at 3.53 um, on May the 15th. So she's a little tour. She was supposed to be a Gemini. But I'm just happy, you know, that she's here. She's healthy. And I didn't have to have a C-section. But, y'all, I'm going to show y'all what my living room looks like. I told y'all we're supposed to be moving literally next week. And all of these Amazon boxes just keep coming. They just keep coming. But my best friend is coming over to help me, like, declutter. So I'm so thankful. I've learned to not turn down when people want to help me. Because I'm always the type of person, like, no, I got it, I got it. And then I get overwhelmed. And then I get upset. So... She had a little swing though. That I put together. I'm so proud of myself. I put that together. Daddy didn't hate to put it together. But I did put this together. Your dad is putting together her stroller and he put her base and that together. But I put this together myself. I'll go get you. All right. Nah, she put it together. I didn't help her with that. It's been like that first. Huh? What was that? Let me put that together. I wasn't here. Where were you? Oh, okay. I had to take my Oh, yeah. You was at practice. Um, But, yeah. Let me show y'all. Oh, I'm still a little sore. Very much swollen. But this is what the other side of my house looks like. I'm judging. Y'all. Y'all see all of this? It's, like, so much stuff so like <sighs> still washing i'm washing her clothes i still gotta wash i gotta wash out sheets and stuff because again i told y'all my water broke i just have laundry that i have to wash because we were preparing to you know pack everything up and i'm the type i don't want to um move with any dirty clothes or anything like this is like so that I got some comics right here. I don't want to move um, with, you know, dirty stuff. Like, who does that? But, um, you know, this postpartum recovery, this shit is real. Like, it's a struggle. It's a struggle bus. Like, I was sent home with the, um, with some additional like padding and stuff 
Um, I had got some spray. I'm going to show you. So this is like the little bag that I was discharged with. Um, it got the postpartum underwear. I also got a kit. So I got this kit that I'm about to open. But every time I go to the bathroom, y'all, I gotta change myself, like change the whole pattern. Y'all, like I mind y'all, I haven't I haven't done this in like where's my I haven't done this in like nine years. So Okay, we back. I haven't done this in nine years. So just It's, it's a lot. So, I got, like, some little pads that they showed me how to do. They put the chucks, the blue chucks on there. They line it with the blue chucks, which I had. Um, I also got this in my bathroom. I just got it in here because it was easy. Um, I got the dermal plays, and then I got these little tucks that I put on top of the um, pads and stuff. So yeah, um, I had ended up starting a vlog on Mother's Day and didn't really finish it. I had got my, well, I need to wash my lashes, but I had got my lashes done, my hair done. You know, see, I got the chrome nails. You know, I'm just trying to look cute and homegirl just couldn't wait. She couldn't wait to see me. So I got that stuff. My room looks a mess because I'm actually folding up my son's clothes. And I my OCD is like really kicking in, so I'm trying to like really just get stuff in order. Um, we had to like urgently get everything. Well, we had a lot of stuff for baby girl, but some of the stuff that I did need, we had to urgently like go to Walmart to get like her stroller and car seat. We hadn't got that yet. We were supposed to get it at the end of this week because again, she was not supposed to come till June. So I was thinking she was gonna hold out at least to the end of May. And, you know, but it is what it is. So, I'm just straightening up right now. Um, I am planning to breast and bottle feed. So, I do have a pump that my best friend had got me. My insurance got me one as well. But we also um, got some of these to do for her. So she's just chilling in her swing. And y'all, I got to go to the bathroom. So stay tuned. I'm going to come back. But I need to use the bathroom. And I told y'all, it's a struggle when I have to go to the bathroom. Because every time I go, I have to change. And that's made annoying. So I love this for me. Hey, guys. So I'm back. It's probably been a couple hours um baby girl is like wide awake she just had um her bottle uh and i changed her whole dad changed her and so i'm just relaxing my best friend came over here with my goddaughter and we literally we got done what needed to be done and I feel a little bit better. So I'm just resting my tree trunks because y'all, my ankles are swollen. So I'm just sitting here resting because they hurt. I'm gonna show y'all, hold on. These are my tree trunks and that area looks so much better. Y'all see it? It wasn't like that before. So yeah, don't y'all get on here and judge me. But my feet, oh my God. <sighs> this is what they don't prepare you for after you give birth. Like everything is good. You pregnant. Oh, you looking pretty. But the once that postpartum recovery hit, child, it gets real. And so, you know, I'm trying not to get myself in that stage where I'm depressed or, you know, I'm just not feeling myself. And it's hard. And everybody keeps saying, oh, you just had a baby. You still. <sighs> I know I just had a baby. I know it's only been 48 hours. 
but it's still hard. So, um, I'm going to just continue to show y'all my journey. Everybody's journey is different. I really didn't want to get on here and vlog, but I was just like, I haven't did a video in so long. And, you know, I just, I'm just hoping to help people get through the whole postpartum stage because it's, it's a lot. Like, it's really a lot. And you know some people are more fortunate than others to have you know a good support system i'm not saying that i don't have one i really do um as y'all can see my best friend literally came over here helped me break down these boxes because uh, like i said again we're moving and so it's just a lot like baby girl you know just came unexpected you know so i'm glad she's here i'm glad she's healthy you know i'm glad that i'm doing good it's just the whole recovery part is just really sending me through a loop. Um, I'm not going to tell y'all, like, I expected certain things. Um, you know, I'm starting over nine years later. So it, it hit different, you know. But I'm just hoping to slowly but gradually get back into my, to myself, get back in the swing of things, you know, make sure that baby girl is good, make sure my son is good, make sure the house is good. Um, but right now I really just have to focus a little bit more on me and just resting. And, you know, it's nothing wrong with that focusing on you because at the end of the day, you got to heal to take care of yourself and to take care of your baby. I don't care what anybody says. So it's a journey. It's a struggle for some people. It's not all glitz and glam. Like this is real life stuff. So I'm going to take a shower because I want to eat. She done went back to sleep. Oh, now she up looking around. <laughs> I'm going to shower, eat, and we're just going to get back into the swing of this. My wash machine is about, no, my dryer is about to go off. So I hate that. But um, yeah, we're doing well. This is 48 hours after postpartum. So stay tuned for more videos to drop because it is going to get real so make sure you like comment and subscribe and i'm gonna catch y'all in the next video bye